guys, this is a video, the very short video of where I'm explaining everything about Tough Mudder. So, like I shared in my house tutorial video, well, the link of that will be in the description. Um, this one I got um, Mini Mudder for ages 7 to 12. It's now 12. It used to be 7 and 13 year olds on the same course, but no. Just now, like a week ago, they changed the um <clears throat> the age so now you only have to be 13 to do the 5k or 3.2 miles with 13 obstacles i'm going to be showing most of those obstacles near the end of this video and um the training one i just showed you i got it um because i was a tester so they had a bunch of obstacles and um they see how much kids liked them and then this one I got when you were actually allowed to do it. And then um, in April, I'm going to be getting a Tough Mudder shirt, the five kick shirt. And I'll show you my dad's um, collection, my dad's beautiful collection. This is the half Tough Mudder. This is the full. And this is the 5k tough motor headband that i all oh, these full full 5k and this year they're supposed to be black because my dad's an ambassador so he gets like the inside scoop of tough motor there are multiple obstacles um, like the ones I'm about to show you and um, link in the description for the website for the Tough Mudder. So maybe you can come and join me if you're 13 and older. And if you're younger than that, then you can do the one mile, which is also fun for kids. And um, I would recommend doing Tough Mudder. It is very fun. Um, it Some of the obstacles, you need teamwork. Without teamwork, you cannot do the obstacle. You can't do it by yourself. Majority of them are like that. Tough Matter is teamwork. Um, it's a bunch of fun to like get a group of your friends to do it with you. And um, like I said, I really recommend it. And if you trust me in the tiniest bit, you'll check out the link in the description and you'll just check it out and try it. Okay. And as quickly about my new shoes. So I just got these today. These are my Merrill Tough Matter shoes. And let me take them off for you guys real quick. Um, so these are my Merrill Tough Mudder shoes. So if you guys don't know what Tough Mudder is, my next video I'll be explaining everything about it. And, um, so I'm going to be doing one on April 6th. I'm going to be doing the 5K, which is 3.2 miles. And, um, so these are my second pair of Merrill shoes. My first ones, I've had these for about eight months now. And... This is what the bottom looks like. And these are the brand new ones, what the bottom looks like. So, um, you can see how much I wear it down from this to this, especially if you look at it from the side. And, um, so I'm going to be telling you guys something real quick, um, about these shoes. So, because these shoes are in sections, um, I can tell you guys if this is a sprinter shoe or a distance shoe. So this are this is one section and this is another one. So if you're a sprinter, you'll mainly use the second and third row. But if you're more of a distance person like my dad, then you'll have the third and fourth row. And um so that's how you can look at the bottom of someone's shoe and find out if they are a sprinter or more of a distance person. So the videos that will be coming up also um, is there's going to be a video about um, what I did 
in um, Wisconsin, all the Wisconsin videos and like Hawaii videos. I'm going to be uploading pictures and videos from that. I'm also going to be doing Cabo pictures. I was very young in these pictures. Very adorable little face. So I was, um, that was probably in 2010 or 15. I don't remember. But you'll get to see those videos very soon. And um, like I said, all the links in the description. And like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And I hope to see you at a tough moment.